in my opinion, it's simple. Look, man, if he's my son, he's my son. If he's not, let's cut the charades. That's it. Because some young people get the wrong information and sometimes they get the right information. So in order for him to stand on his own a certain way, to know who his father is, the DNA is necessary. And just, man, just give that up, man. So the young man can know what he's, what, what, what he's dealing with. Kenny Green, raw perspective, concrete and still talking to the people. Good morning, everybody. Hope all is well. The topic today is Jay-Z, the one we all hold in the high regard. Supposedly, he's been in a court battle for the last 10 years. Um, his alleged son, Ramir, Satellite, whatever, you know, might be pronounced it more wrong, is fighting to get a DNA to prove that Jay-Z is his father. I guess in the regular sense of it, we would figure if you had a son out there, you would want to know and you wouldn't make this process difficult. This is going to the Supreme Court now. So somewhere along the line, this may come to a head and Jay-Z may be forced to give up the DNA. There's a lot of children that right now don't know who their parent is. You know what I'm saying? And it just behooves me to see why Jay-Z is denying this at such a level that you've been fighting it for the last 10 years when it's simple. If it's your son, it's your son. But you know what a lot of people is missing is that maybe this long drawn out fight is because if he is biologically Jay-Z's son, he's an heir. He's an heir. There's a level of entitlement that he lands under. And maybe this is what this whole fight is about. So you're trying to prevent this possible biological son from being the heir. So this fight is going to be interesting because sometimes what we got to understand, it's not what we feel and think. It's about the law. And the law may say that <clears throat> this biological biological son of yours has a level of entitlement that you cannot even fully erase him from. So we got to think that's probably what this whole fight is about. But I think we're going to know soon. So Jay-Z possibly can have a son that will become an heir to his massive, massive estate. Think about it. But in the simple base of it, if you have a son, you want to know that's your son. And if your son has a dad, he want to know who his dad is. Concrete and steel. We're going to see how this one plays out. Raw perspective, Kenny Green.